Sharanas and Special Officer Sweep Shiran Peer Singh, and I am DG Media Shivali Sharan. I would request Chief Election Commissioner Sri Rajiv Kumar to kindly give his opening statement, after which the floor would be open for your questions. I would request you to ask your questions subsequently, one by one, after introducing your name and the name of your media organization that you represent. Kindly ensure your mobile phones are on silent mode throughout the conference and there's no disturbance to camera persons in between. Sir, please. Thank you, Chef Ji. My esteemed colleague, Honorable Election Commissioner, Shri Anup Chand Pandeji, senior officials from the Election Commission on the dais, and friends from media who have gathered here today and also those who are connected with us virtually. We meet today for a press conference that most of you have been awaiting and have also been guessing since morning also. October is a month with many festivals and we are adding one more festival that is the Festival of Democracy to this month of October. October ke is uh, tiohar ke mahal mein log tantr ke tiohar ko bhi hum log jod rahe hain election commission ki taraf se jis mein 18 saal se leke 100 varsh tak ke buzurg maddataon ka ek bahut hi bahurangi uh, indra dhanush hai it's a fantastic uh, rainbow of the voters ranging from 18 years to 100 plus and we'll we'll focus a bit on this uh, rainbow I would explain in the detail about this, but in the meantime, to, to move forward, the elections, when we conduct, we have three broad objectives. First is the elections have to be free, fair, inclusive, accessible, and inducement free. And the second major vertical is the voter that the that the voting experience should be very, very comfortable. And thirdly, the maximum voter participation, especially of the young voters, urban voters, PWDs, and senior citizens. These four categories we intend to focus more, which I'll explain. Bharat Nirvachan Ayok Satantra Nispaksh Pralovan Mukt इंड्यूसमेंट फ्री तरीके से विधानसभा का आगामी निर्वाचन चुनाव कराने के लिए प्रतिबद्ध है और हमारा प्रयास है कि वरिष्ठ नागरिकों दिव्यांगजनों महिलाओं नए मतदाताओं सबकी भागीदारी बहुत ही सशक्त तरीके से आने वाले चुनावों में हो दी थ्रू द वास्ट रीच ऑफ द मीडिया आई वुड रिक्वेस्ट फर्स्ट दैट इंटरेक्शन will start with the wish that our appeal is being heard by most of the voters and they will come out to participate wholeheartedly in this forthcoming festival of democracy. Before going into the mode of the elections, we have an extensive process of consultation. And the magnitude and the scale of our elections is really awe-inspiring, as you all know. For the last few months, our entire team, which you are seeing here, has been working on organizing these elections, ranging from the electoral rules to the management of logistics to various things which we will explain. Periodic reviews were done by them. The commission also went to the states where the elections are due. And we had detailed meetings with the DOs, with the SPs, and with all the enforcement agencies, chief secretaries, DGs, and everyone who is involved in either conduct of elections or in the enforcement side of this. We also simultaneously discussed the COVID situation as it has been bothering in the last two rounds of elections. The, we had a detailed discussion with the health secretary, union health secretary, and also with the chief secretaries and DGs of the concerned states, health secretaries. It doesn't seem to be that much of a concern now, but still the states have been advised that they will continue to follow the five-fold strategy of test, track, treat, vaccinate, and follow the appropriate behavior. We have revised our guidelines, which are in this form, essentially saying that they have to follow the norms set by the health ministry, and also the respective SDMAs 
in these states if there is any situation that warrants the tightening or the graded response to the COVID situation. Friends, the first and foremost thing in conducting an election is the electoral roll. A healthy error-free electoral roll is the primary step that is the base on which the entire elections are held. And the summary, special summary revision has just happened. The electoral rolls have been published in the concerned states. And during this exercise, the Commission has laid a special emphasis on registration of new age voters, women, transgenders, and persons with disabilities. In order to ensure a clean electoral roll, this, the photographically similar entries, PSCs, and demographically similar entities, entries have been found through the use of software and field verification. They were circulated to all the DOs and also to the respective BLOs to do a field verification of those who are found to be in the demographically similar entries or the photo similar entries. India TV, हर वक्त हर जगह डाउनलोड करने के लिए सर्च करें इंडिया टीवी न्यूज गूगल प्ले स्टोर या एप स्टोर पर